You done? Okay, you're done. Let's go. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can put this ticker onto your stream within eight clicks or less. So if you've ever tuned in my stream before, you've probably seen this little label ticker sitting on the bottom left hand side of the screen during my gameplay videos or during my just chatting videos as well. So pretty much um, I was able to upload this onto the widget share within stream elements and it's now available for you to use for free on your own stream. So without further ado, let's just get into it, shall we? So once you've clicked on the link down below, you're then going to be met with the My Overlay section within Stream Elements. And what we want to do is we want to look for the Minimalist Label ticker by Colin Horn and then click on Edit. We're then going to go into the Label Editor and you're going to be met with this screen here showing your latest followers, subscriber and uh, the latest bits or cheers uh, from your stream. Now in order to customize this, we want to click on Custom Widget. And then we're going to have the Settings panel here. And this is all the different settings you can customize within this widget for your own stream. Now remember, we are loading in the fonts from google.com, so please go to fonts.google.com to browse the library of what you can select for your own stream. Uh, personally for me, I use Babas New because it's what I use for my own stream. Um, and in here, we can then start selecting the different colors for this widget. We can change the font color by clicking on the little panel here on the left hand side. So let's go for a nice kind of sky blue for the time being. We can also change the background color. I, however, quite like the transparent see-through black behind it, so therefore it doesn't completely obstruct everything on your screen. With the icon color too, you can change the color of these icons. I'm gonna opt to match the font because it's kind of nice seeing them go both hand in hand. However, now we can't actually really see the icons, so now we're gonna change the icon color background. So let's change it to a nice gray. Obviously, you can use the color picker again if you want, um, or you can just type it in if you know what is kind of kind of colors you know off by hand for your hex decimal values and we can also change the color of the wipe itself so once we change the colors of the wipe we can then actually make it look a lot cleaner a lot of the times i tend to kind of match the actual icon background color to the color of the wipe as well so once we change this to a dark gray we can have this this way and then it's going to look something like this which is very nice and sleek and clean looking for your own stream itself once you have done this, then what you want to do is go up to the top right hand corner here and say copy overlay URL. You're then going to go into OBS, select it as a browser source and copy that in. And there we go guys, it's as easy as that. If you've got any suggestions for any widgets you would like to see in the future available on Stream Elements, don't forget to comment down below. If you like the video, like the video. If you want to subscribe to the channel, I am going to be updating this on more of a regular basis with anything to do with streaming tips, stories from streaming, and even some more widgets, and possibly some reviews upon items um, you can use for your own stream as well, but not at the higher grade cost. I also stream live every single Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday on Twitch. If you want to discuss anything to do with streaming, please drop on by the channel. I would really, really appreciate it. But until then, I'll catch you in the next one. See ya. Easy as that. So, uh, for God's sake, Colin, get your words out your mouth. Available for you to use on stream elements for completely free for streaming as well in the near future. You done? Good. Thank you. <laughs>